I first realised I was falling ill when I was about 14 years old and I couldn't concentrate in lessons because I was in school at the time and I couldn't eat properly because I didn't have any appetite and I wasn't getting very much sleep. I just felt down a lot, like I didn't feel happy or any of the good emotions. I just felt sad um, and anxious a lot. And I'd cry all the time, almost every day. And after a while, I'd realise that I was feeling very depressed and I'd get very anxious and get panic attacks. And as that progressed and got worse and worse, I developed psychosis and in the end I needed hospital treatment. Having an illness meant that I'd actually missed two years of school. So I've only got four GCSEs because I was in hospital. I lost quite a lot of friends because they didn't know how to react around me or they didn't, they didn't think they knew how to talk to me. And I think they were quite scared of me. I got quite a lot of comments from people, just general people, things like pull yourself together or snap out of it. And that made me feel quite, it made me feel really bad because I couldn't, I was ill. I've had a mixed experience of CAMS. Um, when I needed hospital treatment, I was offered a bed in Edinburgh, and I was, in the end I was treated in London, which is six hours away from my home, because I live down in Pembrokeshire. And there was long waiting times and not, very, not enough access to talking therapies. However, I can tell that staff do work very, very hard and try their very best to help people. Welsh Government are reviewing CAMS under the Together for Children and Young People programme. If you're under 25 or have experience of CAMS either as a carer or a service user, please complete our survey. Let's make sure our voices are heard in the review of our mental health services.